Are you struggling to build an aesthetic body? Are you one of those skinny guys who have tried everything but nothing seems to work? Let's face it, the journey to a well-sculpted physique is riddled with myths and misconceptions. You've probably been told that you need to eat more, lift more, or even that your genetics are to blame. But here's the truth. Building an aesthetic body is a systematic process, not a random collection of workouts and diets. Well, you're in luck. Today we're breaking down the process into five clear steps. The first step is proper nutrition. It's not just about eating more, but eating right. Imagine your body as a high-performance vehicle. Just like that vehicle, your body needs high-quality fuel to run at its best. This fuel comes in the form of proteins, carbohydrates, and fats. Proteins are the building blocks for your muscles. Carbohydrates provide the energy, and fats are essential for numerous bodily functions. Moreover, to gain weight and build muscle, you need to consume more calories than your body burns, a state known as a caloric surplus. Remember, your body needs fuel to grow, so feed it right. The second step is regular exercise. Building muscle isn't just about lifting heavy weights. It's about developing a well-rounded exercise regimen that includes both resistance training and cardio. Compound exercises like squats and deadlifts are particularly beneficial as they engage multiple muscle groups at once, maximizing your workout efficiency. But remember, it's not about how much you lift, but how you lift. Proper form is essential to prevent injuries and ensure you're targeting the right muscles. Consistency is key. Keep pushing yourself, but remember to listen to your body. The third step is getting adequate rest. Your body grows not when you're working out, but when you're resting. Now let's dive a little deeper into that. Rest and sleep play a pivotal role in muscle recovery and growth. When we sleep, our bodies work overtime, repairing and rebuilding our muscles, making them stronger. On the flip side, overtraining can lead to fatigue, decreased performance, and even injuries. It's like trying to build a skyscraper without letting the cement dry. You're just setting yourself up for a collapse. So make sure you're getting enough sleep and giving your body time to recover. The fourth step is patience and persistence. Building an aesthetic body doesn't happen overnight. It's a journey, a transformation that requires time and consistent effort. You must set realistic expectations and understand that it's not about immediate results, but gradual progress. There will be days when you'll feel like giving up, but remember, persistence is key. Every rep, every workout, every healthy meal brings you a step closer to your goal. So stay patient, keep pushing, and trust the process. Remember, it's a marathon, not a sprint. Keep going and you'll get there. The fifth and final step is to stay motivated. This journey is as much mental as it is physical. Building an aesthetic body isn't just about lifting weights or eating right. It's about the grit, the determination, and the will to keep going even when things get tough. Find what drives you. Whether it's a personal goal, a vision of your future self, or simply the desire to prove that you can. Keep that in mind whenever you're feeling low or unmotivated. Remember, motivation is like a muscle. The more you use it, the stronger it gets. With the right mindset, you can achieve anything. So keep that fire burning. So, there you have it. Five clear steps to build an aesthetic body, even if you're a skinny guy. We've covered the importance of proper nutrition, the role of regular exercise, the necessity of adequate rest, and the power of patience and persistence. We've also touched upon the significance of staying motivated. Each of these elements is a vital piece of the puzzle. Together they form a comprehensive strategy to transform your physique. Remember, the journey to an aesthetic body is a marathon, not a sprint, so keep pushing, stay consistent, and you'll get there.